Not every 19-year-old gets the opportunity to shake hands and greet a head of state, but for Tiffany Chang, it was one of her duties as Miss Taiwanese American 2022. My name is Tiffany Chang, uh, Zhang Fang Yu, and I currently attend Stanford University, majoring in management science and engineering. And this past year, I served as the Miss Taiwanese American Queen of 2022. Tiffany has lived in Los Angeles her entire life. But because of her upbringing, she's very in touch with her Taiwanese roots, including speaking Taiwanese Hokkien, commonly known as Taiwanese. So growing up, I always spoke Taiwanese with my grandma, my grandparents, um, and I was very just in touch with my Taiwanese heritage. Being crowned Miss Taiwanese American helped Tiffany gain a deeper appreciation for her background. We were in the Huntington Beach Parade, seeing a lot of people on the side like cheering for us and being like, oh, go Taiwan, like stay safe. That was really a testament to, you know, how far we've come. Every year, the Taiwan Center Foundation of Greater Los Angeles puts on a pageant to select the next Miss Taiwanese American. The winner of the competition is expected to act as an ambassador for Taiwanese culture throughout the year of their tenure. The selection process is rigorous. In my year, there are 10 finalists. And so after that, you go through a seven to eight week training period, um, training both on Saturday and Sunday for about six to eight hours so throughout those seven to eight weeks about you know, of course, not only the normal like things you would think about when you think about when you hear pageant like catwalk, you know, makeup lessons, but most importantly, Taiwanese culture. You get um, history lessons and uh, cultural lessons as well. And in her bid to become Miss Taiwanese American, Tiffany built a robot which used infrared and AI technology to do a catwalk alongside her. But Tiffany's real responsibilities started only after she won the crown. My favorite event by far was when President Tsai came to visit um, Los Angeles and I was able to not only meet her but of course be the MC for the, her presidential banquet and so that was a really once in a lifetime opportunity. At a young age, Tiffany took it upon herself to represent Taiwan, a country she wasn't even born in, but has come to appreciate and love because of her heritage. Programs like the Miss Taiwanese American pageant help American-born Taiwanese not only learn more about their roots, but also give them a chance to act as a bridge between the two sides. Lee Sun and Leslie Liao in Burlingame, California for Taiwan Plus.